whole truth and nothing but the truth. Sitting here today, I cannot tell you why it took so long for a safety defect to be announced. It involves vehicles we no longer make, but it came to light on my watch, so I'm responsible for resolving it. While I cannot turn back the clock, as soon as I learned about the problem, we acted without hesitation. We told the world we had a problem that needed to be fixed. We did so because whatever mistakes were made in the past, we will not shirk from our responsibilities now or in the future. That begins with my sincere apologies to everyone who has been affected by this recall, especially the families and friends who lost their lives or were injured. I am deeply sorry. I've asked former U.S. Attorney Anton Velukas to conduct a thorough and unimpeded investigation of the actions of General Motors. I've named a new Vice President of Global Vehicle Safety, a first for General Motors. I am pleased to announce that we have retained Kenneth Feinberg as a consultant, having led the compensation efforts involved with 9-11, the BP oil spill, and the Boston Marathon bombing. Mr. Feinberg brings ex expertise and objectivity to this effort. As I see it, GM has civil responsibilities and legal responsibilities. We are thinking through exactly what those responsibilities are and how to balance them in an appropriate manner.